Good night. And God bless America and the entire world. Thank you. Okay. So I'm going to wrap things up here, guys. Um, I'll never forget when um, Desert Storm took place. I was 25 years old. And I was concerned. I was I was frightened because, you know, uh, I didn't go through Vietnam. I didn't have to be drafted. I was concerned, you know, what's going to happen with me and my generation. <clears throat> I remember, I'll never forget, <clears throat> last time I really partied in Westport, I was up there, and there were a bunch of guys going over to Iraq for Desert Storm. We freaking owned it. We owned it. Since then, we've gone through uh, September the 11th. We've gone through the invasion of uh, Iraq and Afghanistan. Uh, I know many of you disagree with that. Uh, millennials, you haven't dealt with this before. I respect you. I don't think you're all a bunch of snowflakes. But welcome to the real world, kids. Welcome to the real world, 18 to 34-year-olds. This is the real world. This is how we deal with despotism. This is how we deal with inhumanity. We go in and we fucking kick ass, right? Pray for our soldiers. Pray, pray for those who have been there. Pray for those who have finally had their hands unbound to do something positive for humanity. In the name of uh, freedom and humanity and the United States of America, all right? I don't want to sound too preachy, but millennials, welcome. This could be the very beginning of a coming of age for your generation and a realization that the world is not populated with safe spaces. Okay? It's not. And when spaces are invaded by space invaders, hey, by despots who would use chemical weapons on children and families, you have to buck up and say, we're going to take you out. We're going to take you out. Say a prayer for our uh, our leaders, including Mr. Donald J. Trump, even if you don't like him. Pray for our military and pray for those who would have been victimized and would be victimized by the Assad regime uh, and any despotic regime in the uh, in the world. Okay. So, interesting night. Thanks for chiming in. God bless you guys. Have a good night. We'll check in tomorrow. Thanks for uh, watching tonight. We'll see you soon. <laughs>